Hi, hello friends. Welcome to Brighter API. I am Milan Mehta. In this tutorial, we are going to learn a breaking breaking the records algorithm. So let's go to our hacker and talk. So this is my breaking the records uh, algorithm. Okay. This is my hacker rank account. Okay. Uh, so uh, Maria plays n games in the College of Basketball in the season because she wants to go in the pro. Uh, she tracks her uh, points in the record per game sequentially in the array of score that s zero s one to s n minus one. After each game of i, she checks to see if s of i s of i breaks her record something like that okay so let me let me explain you easily uh, what they want to say is that uh, maria is playing the game so suppose that we are playing that she is playing a nine game okay so uh, they are storing it in the array so in the first game she she makes the record 10 okay uh, in the second game which is the record is 5 so 5 is the less than of uh, 10 okay so uh, 10 is the uh, lowest score till now okay after the 20 20 is the highest score okay so uh, third in the third game it's a 20 so they are not doing anything okay uh, uh, in the fourth game they are four so four is the lowest in the fifth game they uh, they are storing it uh, in the fifth game there is a five so four is the lowest so uh, five you will not consider two two is the lowest so two okay uh, 25 25 is the Highest, so they are the twenty-five, okay. and eight. Eight is a one. So how many? Uh, uh, we need to count that how many highest score and how many lowest score. So if you will consider the twenty and twenty-five, that is the highest score, and the five, four, two, one. So four is the lowest. Score. So we need to find that. So uh, they will input that. Uh, the uh, input is that they will insert. The the ten number of game Maria is playing and the score of the ten. Okay, so let's understand the solution. Okay, so they have maker one class. Okay, uh, in that what they are going to do, they they are taken n value, which is the that how many numbers of uh, game they are playing. Okay, after that what they have done that uh, the numbers of uh, array they are taking, and after that they are calling one function. That get the record, get records. Okay, so so we we need to create that function, and we need to call it. And after that, they are it uh, result they are iterating, and they are just printing it. So we need not to worry for that. So let's create one function. We need to create. Okay, so we need to create a one function which should be a static function, static integer, which should be written an array. So because it is written in an array, okay. So what is the function? Now? Get records. Okay, they are passing an. S. So what is the S? S is an array. Okay. So we need to take a input parameter integer S, or we can write this thing as well. Okay. It's fine. Okay. Uh, what we need to return it? We need to return a result. So we are whatever we are going to result uh, return, we are just declaring here. Okay. We need to just return a two because the highest score and the lowest score. Okay. Uh, Now, now what we need to do? Uh, we need to hold the two variables. One is that how many numbers of times they are getting the highest score and the lowest score. Okay. Uh, and the another thing, what was the highest score as well? We need to hold that thing. So for the simplifying from all the array, I am just basically practices that uh, using a collection, and we are just using a hash map. So uh, I am just taking one hash map. Where we will in, uh, input as an integer, okay? So highest is equal to new hash map. And we need to take another variable. So uh, we need to match the variable with the sum variable. So what we will do, we will store a zeroth variable to the both. Okay. So here we can see that the highest score is stored in the and the lowest score is the zero. So we can store that first thing. So we can compare it easily. Okay. So highest is equal to uh, s of zero. Okay. Uh, we need to store a s of zero. What it 
exactly that with the highest Okay. Now, now what we are going to do? We need to iterate a loop. So we have already stored a zeroth variable. So we need to start a loop with the one. Okay. And what in what the variable we need to iterate? Length. Okay. As dot length. Put parameter n. Okay. And the i. Now what? Uh, we need to match with it that s of i is greater than with what number of that with the highest highest what we are storing highest dot get okay so highest dot get okay uh, what we need to compare we need to compare the last of the map okay the last so what we need to take that highest dot size okay. Size minus one. Okay. Size minus. One. We need to compare with the last value of the map. Okay. Okay. So after that, if we there is a twenty five is already and in twenty five is the cup which which is the highest value. So what we need to do? We need to put. Highest dot put. What the number of variable we need to put at what number? So here, so we have stored at the zero element. If there is a something, it should be stored at the one. But we will not put with the i. What we need we need to put that highest dot size. Okay, because we have already starting with the zero, so we can store that highest dot size of s of i. So five number we will store. Same thing. What we will do for that, we need to do for the lowest. So here, just I am replacing it. Here, we need to check a less than. Less than. The lowest. So same uh, same uh, logic is applicable. Whatever I had explained in the highest, okay. And what we need to do is we need to return it, okay. We need to return it. We need to store firstly with the result, result of zero. So we need to result of zero. Zero is equal to highest. Highest, highest dot size. Okay, highest dot size. Okay, we have already stored a one a one value in the first map, so we need to minus it with the one because we have already stored for the just comparison person. So now here we are not going to compare anything. We need to remove that of the size because we have already one as an extra. Okay, and the here will store a. Let's try to run the code because uh, it might show a comparison compilation error. Oh, okay. So what it shows that we have stored. Okay, we have not declared uh, integer with the result. Okay. So I think that is the error. So another error. Okay. 
about to mention a size lowest dot size. Okay. So this is the code. This it is not showing all the compilation error while we are typing the code. That's why we are facing some issue. Okay, so let, let's now submit the code and uh, let's check that uh, we have passed all the test cases or not. Congratulations guys, we have completed this challenge. Keep following and keep subscribing Writer API. Thank you for watching. Thank you.